Hey everyone, it's Emily from thestylishgeek.com. So I've been working pretty much nonstop for the past couple weeks or so on my cosplay for San Diego Comic Con, and I just want to take some time to maybe show you guys what I've been up to and some progress I've been making. So I'm going as an anime Darth Vader character that I saw on DeviantArt. The way it was drawn really inspired me. Uh, the costume was really beautifully done, and I thought it was like a great design. And I haven't really seen that many female Darth Vaders except. Um, ones in corsets or like kind of sexy Darth Vader so I thought this was like a really great um, piece of art but I know it's kind of crazy because it's going to be a really hot costume I'm already kind of worried about that which is why I'm trying to wear this around the house and try to get used to it but um, we'll see how it goes but yeah let me just show you guys around and show you some stuff that I've made so far all right so this first part is the top and the bottom I made them two pieces because I thought it would be a lot easier to wear, maybe a little bit less restrictive and less hot. Um, so this is stretch PVC and I quilted the whole thing so I pretty much quilted the arms, the body, the back is just a normal back. Uh, it has a slight turtleneck so it's extra hot. So I quilted it by layering three pieces of fabric, the stretch PVC, and then underneath that is a layer of batting which is usually used for quilts to keep you nice and warm. And then underneath that is another layer of spandex. So together, when you sew the lines on top of it, it creates like a quilting effect. So here are the leggings. They're pretty basic leggings. Um, I just quilted the entire front half. The bottom half's not quilted since I'll be wearing shin guards. And then you can see here, there's um, the layers of the spandex and then the batting underneath and then another mesh fabric. We have the pauldrons or the chest armor. Um, I just started this a couple hours ago, so it's definitely quite a learning experience because I'm making it out of Warbla and I've never used Warbla before, so um, it's kind of like you learn as you go, try to watch a lot of videos before you actually start. And the reason I have foil everywhere is because I saw that um, online they said if you use foil it won't stick to it, so you know I don't want it sticking to the mannequin and stuff. So here's another piece that I've started that will go on top of the chest armor, so I think there's maybe like three layers um, in front, and then there's a couple of stripes on the side. This black thing is kind of like an inner cape that Vader wears, and it's kind of tucked under the belt, so it'll just kind of drape around the waist and the back. I also made the fancy cod piece, which is a lot smaller than the guy version, so I'm kind of glad it's not so like weird. So here's my disaster of a workplace. Um, you can see that I started on these belt boxes. They're also made of Warbla. Haven't really gotten too far because I'm waiting on some lights to come in. This is basically a template for the chest armor I found online. And you can basically just use a photocopier and enlarge it to your size. So here are some Vader figures I have to keep me company. Um, this one's really cool. It's really detailed. Um, unfortunately, the lightsaber broke off. It actually comes with a really big cape, which is over there. But um, I wanted to see the back, so that's kind of cool. You can actually see the back on this figure. And this one is a vintage figure. It's pretty cool because you can put in a coin and it plays a lot of music and he moves around a little bit. But you can see it's not completely accurate because it doesn't even have the gray and black stripes on the front. But he's good company, so. So that's all I have for now. Hopefully I'll make a lot of progress this weekend and have more updates. And if you see me at San Diego Comic Con, come say hi and make sure I'm not about to pass out. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll geek out with you guys later. Bye!